Good day, hey, hi, and welcome. All right, let me. Okay, uh, let me tell you about the time my chainsaw cut ziggity zaggity. It was cutting, but ziggity zaggity, ziggity zaggity, ziggity zaggity, ziggity. But the, I don't know if that comes out on the camera the way. Watch, ziggity zaggity, ziggity zaggity, ziggity zaggity. You know when you do, did that thing with, with the pencil when you were a kid? So you do it on the short part. Ziggity zag. Oh, okay, that one's hard. Ziggity zag. Zig. Okay. <laughs> If I've made half of my audience puke from uh, delirium, I apologize. Okay, so here's what's happened. So here's Mini Beast here. He's just going to get a nice little touch up. Look, see, that looks good. That looks good. That looks gooder. Good. Goodest. Good. Goodish. Good, good, good. Good, good. Marvelous. Wonderful. Charming. Lovely. Good, 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 good. Oh, that's okay. That's good. That's good. So yeah, pretty. That's a pretty good looking chain. But mind you, I haven't done anything stupid with this all other, other than just cut its mini beast way. But let's have a look at this chain. Ooh. E. Mm. Eh. Yeah. Eh. What? That's almost straight. What? Oh. Okay. So anyway, here's what's happened. <laughs> Once again, uh, yesterday, I had to cut up. Uh, finished cutting up. Uh, some of the uh, birch that I uh, birch tree that I fell But a week or so ago, uh, I gave the saw a sharp and I thought my rakers were down a bit, but uh, are not enough uh, But my cut was starting to do this so it's like okay, and I kind of sharpened it yesterday I think that last stump venture really really hurt my uh, hurt my chain to the point where it wasn't cutting like that's what a tooth is supposed to look like and this is what i got for most of them so it's going to take a little while to get this back and sharpening so yesterday it, it cut but it was it felt like it was spinning on the on the rakers so i took the rakers down a bit it cut a bit better after i did the rakers but it was still cutting crooked so what i got to do is get the teeth to kind of level out so that's normal that's not that's yeah that yeah that's okay yeah yeah, that's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell is that? <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So what? I, what I did yesterday also too was I uh, deburred the bar. Uh, I was going to flip the bar yesterday, but it looked like I, it wasn't because I, I didn't have my glasses. I couldn't tell if there was the oiler for the other side to be able to flip the bar. If the oiler's not there, you can't flip the bar because then you can't get oil into the bar. Uh, but I'm going to give it a good sharpen up again, see if I can get these teeth back into order, especially ones like this where it's almost completely straight, uh, you know, rounded off. Uh, get it back to about that, that then, because what happens when you have teeth at a different uh, angles from each other, you get different rates of cut, which will pull your saw to one side or the other. And... Uh, or pull your cut from one side to the other. Um, I don't have a block with me to show you what the cut looks like when your saw is starting to cut crooked. But it also, it it, uh, it jams your saw in the log. You cut and then somewhere around there, it, it, it starts to jam up and you can't saw anymore because you're basically caught between, you know, your, your blade's misaligned or the, the bar's misaligned in, in the cut. It's starting to, you know, which is hard on your bar. So... Uh, needless to say, I wasn't able to really work with them yesterday. Uh, and I didn't have time to sit there and sharpen the, really do a good sharpening on it. So I just grabbed this guy and bucked the rest of the blocks on the side of the 30 degree hill or whatever it was. And this guy just did fantastic as he normally does. But this guy never removes stumps. Uh, I'll do branches with him. I'll do uh, trees. But I don't do anything close to the ground or close to metal. So this, I haven't hit anything with this yet. Uh, but I'm going to give everything a touch up and this one I'm going to give this chain a really good going over and uh, the bar I'm going to see if I can flip it I'm going to take it off and have a look at it again just to see if I can flip it so that your bar wears evenly uh, but yeah it, it was quite the zigzag cut there yesterday ziggity, 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 ziggity. anyway yeah so all right so there we go uh, I'll take sharpen up take the bar off sh see if I can flip the bar and I'll show you when I do